iron is one of the micronutrients which are necessary for crop growth. This is another tutorial by Grandwa Africa and today you will learn about iron deficiency in your crops. The major function of iron is chlorophyll formation. Chlorophyll is commonly known as the green coloring matter. Chlorophyll is very important for any crop because it helps convert light, carbon dioxide in the atmosphere and water fed through the roots into food that helps crop growth. Chlorophyll is therefore what makes the leaves have that beautiful green color. If a leaf lacks chlorophyll, it loses the green color and obtains a yellow color. Such a yellowish leaf is called chlorotic because it has lost its chlorophyll. Back to iron deficiency. Iron deficiency shows on the younger leaves of crops and is easily noticeable due to the yellowing of the leaf veins. Such yellowing is also called intravenal chlorosis. The leaves showing intravenal chlorosis may later seem as if they are totally bleached in acute deficiency of the said nutrient. Just a quick recap from our other video, magnesium and manganese deficiencies may show yellowing of leaves between the veins. Such yellowing also occurs in older leaves, unlike iron deficiency, which occurs in younger leaves. On the other hand, iron deficiency shows on young leaves, and the yellowing is in the veins, intravenal. Iron deficiency is easy to correct in hydroponic systems. Any hydroponic grower must have a comprehensive water analysis carried out before production begins. This water analysis helps a farmer know which nutrients are lacking, or in excess, or insufficient. To correct iron deficiency in a hydroponic system, the grower is first encouraged to feed the crops with iron supplements such as chelated iron granules, which have to be dissolved in water. Iron 2 sulfate is not as effective since it dissociates into iron and sulfate ions when dissolved in water. Iron ions need to be bound to something like EDTA for effective translocation and absorption. The hydroponic grower should always maintain a pH of 5.5 to 6.5 to maximize absorption of all nutrients. The hydroponic grower may also get a fatigation schedule free from Grandwa Africa upon request via our email grandwaafrica at gmail.com. The farmer working with soil is first encouraged to do a comprehensive soil analysis to show the physical and chemical properties of the soil. The results from such an analysis will then guide the farmer on the fatigation schedule needed to optimize the soil accordingly. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel for more of such informative videos. As iron sharpens iron, likewise, share this video with other farmers to sharpen them on iron deficiency symptoms. Or like our Facebook page, Grandwa Africa. Log on to our website, www.grandwaafrica.com, for more information.